we are presenting a new algorithm for predicting trajectories of road agents in dense traffic videos. Our approach is designed for heterogeneous traffic where the road agents may correspond to buses, cars, scooters, bicycles, or pedestrians. We model the heterogeneous interactions between different road agents using a novel LSTM-CNN hybrid network. In particular, we take into account heterogeneous interactions that implicitly accounts for the varying shapes, dynamics, and behaviors of different road agents. In addition, we also model the horizon-based interactions which are used to implicitly model the driving behavior of each road agent. Our approach is designed for dense and heterogeneous traffic scenarios and is based on two observations. The first observation is based on the idea that road agents in dense traffic do not react to every road agent around them. Rather, they selectively focus attention on key interactions in a semi-elliptical region in the field of view called the horizon. Consider a motorcyclist who suddenly moves in front of a car and whose neighborhood consists of other road agents such as three-wheelers and pedestrians. The car must prioritize the motorcyclist interaction over the other interactions to avoid a collision. The second observation stems from the heterogeneity of various different road agent interactions including cars, buses, rickshaws, pedestrians, bicycles and animals in the neighborhood of a road agent. For instance, the dynamic constraints of a bus-pedestrian interaction differ significantly from a pedestrian-pedestrian or even a car-pedestrian interaction due to the differences in road agent shapes, sizes, maneuverability, and behaviors. Often, different drivers have different driving styles. Some are more aggressive and others more conservative. We also model the road agent's behavior as it directly influences driving styles, thereby affecting the road agent's navigation. To capture these heterogeneous road agent dynamics, we embed these properties into the state space representation and feed them into our hybrid network. We now describe our algorithm to predict the trajectory for a particular road agent. We start by computing its horizon and neighborhood. We identify all the road agents inside the union of the neighborhood and horizon. Each such agent has an input state space that is used to create input embeddings. Our network constitutes of a horizon layer and a neighborhood layer. The horizon layer processes all the agents inside the horizon and models the horizon-based weighted interaction. The neighborhood layer performs a similar function for all the agents inside the entire neighborhood. The embeddings from each layer are passed to a single layered LSTM as input. The output of the LSTMs are hidden state vectors. The hidden state vector of the horizon-based weighted interaction goes through an additional linear layer and is followed by an ELU nonlinearity. The hidden vectors of the horizon and neighborhood layers are pooled into maps called the horizon map and the neighborhood map. Both these maps are then used as inputs to a ConNet which is comprised of two convolutional operations followed by a max pool operation implemented in each layer. The bottommost layer corresponds to the egocentric vehicle, the input embedding of which passes through the LSTM network to compute its hidden vector. The feature vectors from the horizon and the neighborhood layers are concatenated with the ecocentric hidden vector to generate a final vector encoding. Finally, the concatenated vector encoding passes through a decoder LSTM to compute the prediction for the next tau seconds. We present a new dataset comprising of 48 videos of dense and heterogeneous traffic. The dataset consists of various road agents such as cars, buses, trucks, rickshaws, pedestrians, scooters, motorcycles, and domestic animals. The dataset is categorized according to camera motion, camera viewpoint, time of the day, and difficulty level. The videos are RGB and in high resolution. We present a comparison of our dataset with standard traffic datasets in the paper. For evaluation, we observe 3 seconds of trajectory history and predict the next 5 seconds. We use the following standard metrics to measure the performance of algorithms used for predicting the trajectories of road agents. We compare our algorithm with the following methods and use 4 variants of our approach. We outperform state-of-the-art on our new dataset and observe similar performances on sparser datasets. We now show additional results on our new dataset. 